What's up guys? Welcome to the channel Rock in the Country. I'm Don. Today it's the Billy Willie Show. This is a subscriber request. Ron Williams, shout out to you my friend. You requested Billy Joe Shaver with Willie Nelson. So I'm doing their song Hard to Be an Outlaw and I'm guessing it would be. I am wearing this hat because they're both from Texas. According to the little bit of research I did, Billy is from Corsicana, Texas, and Willie is from Abbott, Texas. So the Texas boys, I don't know who they root for. Could be anybody, could be nobody. And maybe they kept that private, who knows? But in any case, I'm wearing it. That's kind of it. I did Billy Joe Shaver's song, Ragged Old Truck, yesterday. And good God, what a song. If you didn't see that reaction, man, oh man, what a song. Let's just get into this one. Hard to be an outlaw. Let's find out why. And I don't know if they're talking about like an outlaw musician or a legit outlaw, you know. So we're going to find out. That's got a Western feel to it. She was cute and speckled pup. Just turned 21. She had a lot of fun playing with my gun. Just before uh -huh. the sun come up, she couldn't take no more. She come on down crying and crawling for the door. And it's hard to be an outlaw who ain't wanted anymore. And the only friends that's left is now behind those swinging doors. And it's hard to keep your tribe. When your back is to the floor And it's, it's hard, hard to be an outlaw Playing wall is anymore Why lightning is the whole sound right Pedal to the floor He blows fire from his nostrils And he runs like man of war Someday we both may wind up In some junkyard on the sun but till that day, you can bet your ass we're gonna whip that ride. And it's hard to be an outlaw who ain't wanted anymore. Yeah, and the only friends that's left is them behind those swinging doors. And it's hard to keep your triumph when your back is to the floor. It's hard to be an outlaw who ain't wanted anymore. You know, this song reminds me in a way thematically of like when the Godfather movie came out for the first time. And in a sense, it drew you in to like the mob life. And there were people who were upset that it glorified it. And in some ways it did, because then Godfather 2 and 3 and then other mob movies came out. And there's sort of like this air of like intrigue and curiosity and you're kind of rooting for these guys to not get shot. And then the Sopranos come out and, and you kind of like, you start to attach yourself to the characters in them. And you're like, oh, like, and then you're like, wait a minute, the dude has killed like 11 people already. And that's kind of the vibe I'm getting here where it's like, I find myself getting drawn in like, oh, why would anybody be mean to an outlaw? And it's like, they're freaking outlaws. They did something wrong and they keep doing wrong. So it's sort of thematically, though, it's like, what do you call that? Dr. Dave, you'll know this. It's, I think it's Stockholm Syndrome, where, like, somebody gets kidnapped and they're, and they're held, like, in the basement for months or years or wherever, and they, and they start to have feelings for their captor. And you're like, what happened to us? Like, you know, that that would even be a syndrome, you know? If somebody did that, you'd want them hanged. Or something. All right, let's see where this goes. It sure makes you feel something, this sound. Dry dirt. Some superstars nowadays get too far off the ground. Singing about the back roads they never have been down. Ah. They go and call it country, but that ain't the way it sounds. 
It's enough to make a renegade want to terrorize the town. <laughs> it's hard to be an outlaw. They wanted him home. There it is. And the only friends that's left is him behind those swinging doors. And it's hard to keep your trial when your back is to the floor. It's hard to be an outlaw. They wanted him home. It's hard to be an outlaw They won't hit him anymore <laughs> The way I heard that song is they did both. It's like I said on the beginning, hard to be an outlaw. They did it a legit outlaw. Hard to be that, understandably so. But then he brought it into country music. Yeah, I don't know when this song came out. Now you guys can say if you want, but... They were clearly coming after it toward the end, tied it all into coming after country music. You know, you've never been down these dirt roads and you're singing about them. Yeah, I mean, that's one of the knocks, you know. Holy smokes. That was, that was a, uh, that was more than a movie. It was like a poem mixed with a movie mixed with something else. Yeah, to, I mean, it sort of had a feel at times of being almost like in a country, uh, in a college classroom, you know, like it's how to, like trying to understand concepts that you're not totally familiar with or where's this going? Yeah, I had that in like some of the law classes I had taken where the professor would outline some of the details of a legal case. And you're thinking, oh, that's wrong. Or how do they do that? Why would they make a law like that? Why would they? And then you find out what the people are really doing behind the scenes and why they needed to make that law. And you're like, oh, now I see it. It's because they had tinges of that when I was listening to this song. All right, so what do I rate a song like that? Uh, I did like the instrumentation on it. I liked it a lot. You know, it just was very certainly non-pop i mean and it's like look if we're gonna slam nashville we cannot have a single pop element in this thing and they didn't not what i heard i'm giving this song like an even 9.0 yeah there was something in it that was missing for me but I, I don't know what but there was a lot in it so and of course willie and then billy joe the willie billy show on this song just phenomenal i mean yeah, well, I'm going to leave it as a nine right now. You guys might hammer me for that, and some might love it. You know, that's just the nature of opinions, but that's it. All right, so Ron Williams, that was Billy Joe Shaver and Willie Nelson's Hard to Be an Outlaw. It sure is <laughs> on multiple levels. <laughs> there you go. All right, I'll see you in another video, guys. Hope you enjoyed that. Have a great day and keep rocking the country. Yeah.